Hi guys, this is Pete from Mixcat and I want to thank you for listening to this video on search engine optimization. We all know how important it is to get organic traffic to your website. This is really the lifeline for your website. Now there are many ways to get traffic to your website. Today I'm going to focus on one that's within everybody's budget, free. Now you're probably thinking, how do I get free traffic to my website? Well, it's a great question. Lots of great articles have been written on this very topic. There's also a lot of misinformation out there and just information that's outdated. The first thing that you're going to want to do is make sure that your website has proper meta tags. Meta tags are super important. Meta tags are also invisible to the person visiting the site, but this is exactly what the search engines are looking for. The meta tags actually sit at the top of the HTML document in the head section. The meta tags include information about the keywords, description, the author of the website, also the robot statement which tells the search engine how to crawl the website. It also talks about the title of the document. That's what you see at the very top of your browser. A real simple tip is make sure you never use the word home. Even though it's your home page, pack that with some keywords. If it's a web page about real estate, say Orlando Real Estate, try to be real descriptive and use a lot of keywords that's brought up in your website. Now the keyword section in the meta is very important. Make sure to use keywords that are brought up many times within your website. It must be relevant to your website. Don't just cram in keywords that you think people are searching for to get more traffic to your site. You'll actually get penalized for this. I really can't say it enough. Just keep it very specific to your site and the keywords that you're trying to target. Now the next section is the description. You also want to do the same. Keep it very keyword rich and specific to your website. Make sure that you write a very attractive description and definitely proof it for errors. This is actually what shows up in the search engine rank. Now let's say the website's about Orlando real estate. The description should read like find your dream home in Orlando, Florida. Prices start at and your lowest teaser price to get people to the website but realistic. Never say something in your description that you actually don't have on the website. Again keep it relevant to the website. Now the next thing is the actual website itself. Lots of people make their site very flashy. You have to find a great mix between aesthetically pleasing and still lots of relevant information that that website or search engine can crawl. To explain that a little bit better, search engines like Google, Yahoo, MSN, when they pull up your website, they actually just extract all the text from the website. So again, you got to make sure you really think about the text that you have on the site and keep it relevant and definitely stuff that people are going to be searching on to find you. Again, if we're talking about a real estate site, it should be Orlando real estate should be all over the site, maybe subtowns within Orlando. Make sure not to repeat keywords too many times because this is actually considered stuffing and you'll get penalized for it. I have some free tools on Mixcat that will actually help you with the um, meta tags and keywords. It will analyze this site and tell you exactly how it stacks up. If you look over in the video description section, I'll provide links to those very tools. Now the next thing that's very important is link backs to your website. This will help establish that you have a reputable website. Remember to stay away from those FFA link backs, which is actually free for all. These FFA sites just have tons and tons of spam on it and the search engines actually will penalize you for having links on those sites. A great way to get good link backs is actually purchasing the links. Now be very careful when you're buying link backs. You're going to want to buy link backs from sites that have high traffic and also have parallel keywords to your website. What's really neat about this is if you buy a link from another site that's popular in the search engines, it instantly lends credibility to your site, especially if it has parallel keywords. On submit.mixcat.com, we have a link directory that has many different categories. 
we sell permanent link backs starting at two dollars so it's a real value and the top five bidded links actually show up on the front page of mixcat.com this is a really great way to get your site noticed there's also link brokers out there again you want to be very careful when choosing a link broker do a Google search on that link broker and make sure they don't have any complaints against them. If you follow these easy methods, you're well on your way to getting good ranking on Google, Yahoo, and MSN. Remember, the top search engines essentially is free traffic for you, and free traffic can turn into sales, which means money. I hope you found this video helpful.